my chemist wants a 16-hour tattoo condensed into six hours, but he's squirming like a little bitch. God damn, damn this. All right, that's, oh, All right. You gotta finish it, man. No, they have the coffee. Uh. A dragon mouth. In your armpit. Yeah. Oof. Armpit. A wolf's mouth in my armpit. There's some going. The armpit is a very sensitive area, and people don't sit very well. So whoever gets armpits, they're gonna have a tough time. I have no idea what's coming. Oh, no. Ow, 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 ow. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Please, hold on. Hold on. Please. My canvas is being sissy. It's making me stop every two seconds. Ow. Hold on, hold on again. I'm going into freak out mode. I suffer from bipolar disorder, and sometimes my emotions get in the way. I'm beyond furious at this point. I just want to finish the tattoo. I know. Ready to rock and roll? <laughs> if he doesn't make it through this, <laughs> he's basically sending me home. Oh. Towards the end is the worst part. You made it this far, you're doing really good. All I can do is try to coach her down a little bit, keep her from tapping out on me. You all right? Yeah. I can power through. Bear with me. I really need to win against Earl. That will prove that I deserve to be here. Ah. Ah. Marissa, you went head to head with Earl. For this idea, fitting in the armpit, I do commend you on getting a lot of these lines and they're really clean in this very tender part of the body. You've taken some pretty heavy beatings up here. Yeah. And this is not one of those days. Oddly enough, this is probably my favorite tattoo I've seen you do. Earl. This thing is ugly, bro. This was a living nightmare. By 10 minutes in, he was crying. This tattoo is riddled with weird choices. On the side of the nose, there's those two divots that almost look like that maybe where his eyes would be. That's literally off the picture. Just because your reference was a real photo doesn't mean that the tattoo is real looking. You made this look like his eyes yeah, dude, one are on his upper lip. It's crazy. Between Marissa and Earl. It's obviously Marissa. I gotta go with Marissa too. Marissa. Winner of the head-to-head -head challenge is Marissa. biomechanical theme on the end of my nub. Okay. From probably the kneecap up. Okay. This guy doesn't have just one little scar. The entire surface is one big scar. How you holding that? It's a little more sensitive than I figured it would be. Unfortunately, my canvas has been through so many surgeries, his nerves are all up. One moment, he's fine. The next moment, <laughs> He's in excruciating pain. I might not be able to finish this tattoo, but we'll get through it, man. Five, four, three, two, one. That's it. Time's up. Machine's down. No more ink. Eric. You've used his muscle shapes to contour the mechanisms you put in there. Definitely shows artistry. You did some really clean, strong outlining. Even though it's thin, it works really well with the contrast. I think you did a great job. Thank you. Angel of death. Yeah, he loves it. Hi. He is going to <laughs> bricks today. <laughs> the ribs suck to tattoo. Black and gray isn't my strong suit. This sounds like a nightmare from the start to finish. How do you want to do it? Pocket up the angel. Okay. He has a staff standing by a tombstone with the crow there with his hand out. Do you want to do like a full body type of thing? Yeah. I'm at the mercy of this asshole who will not budge on his idea. Do you feel comfortable just doing him? Nah, man. I need it to look like this apocalyptic in the background. You know, I'm gonna put a background behind it. Um... That's a lot of to cram into a six hour tattoo on the ribs, you know? There's no way I'm gonna be able to pull this off. Keep pushing through. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Get this man. Yeah, I got it right. I got it. I think Kyle's in trouble. Kyle's dude's hurting a little bit. And the drawing sucks. And there's some real shaky lines in it. My chemist wants a 16 hour tattoo condensed into six hours, but he's squirming like a little bitch. God damn, damn this. All right, that's. Oh, 
finish it, man. No, stay on the coffin. Ah. Great tattooers go home all the time on this competition because you're at the mercy of your canvas, and this dude is done. I think I'm going home. Don't plan your funeral before your body dies. Even if he was being a dick, Kyle is still my little brother, and I love him, and I want him to do well. It's so difficult knowing that I can't do anything to help him out. Kyle. I like the illustration, but you shaded over your own artwork. What you're missing here, man, is different values. Contrast. You've got one tone of black. You got the same value in the cloak, the beard, the staff, the hood, the wing, and the background. Something's got to be lighter or darker. I definitely would have gone in there with more tones had he been able to sit longer. This one's probably the biggest struggle you've had since you've been here. Heads are difficult to tattoo. The pain is pretty bad. You're getting a lot of sheer force, you know, just, just repeatedly banging on your skull. You're seeing stars. Mm. There's a lot of nerves, and it's very painful to try to squeeze a whole head tattoo and rush something like that. I, I just don't think it's a smart idea. Give me, uh, give me like two more minutes, and we'll let you take a break. Cool. cool. Is that cool? You yeah, sure? Yeah, yeah. All right. I just want to kill the spot, so I don't have to go back into it. I definitely have to rush a little bit, but the one thing I want to do is I want to prove people wrong. I want to be able to finish. My client's in a lot of pain. He started like losing his eyesight a little bit from, you know, all the rattling. <coughs> Dude, I'm gonna get somebody. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Can you get EMT? At this point, his body's cutting out. Hey. hey. Look a little pale there. Feeling nauseous. I knew going into this that I took a piece that was huge. I was pretty confident I could finish it. I'm not finished. I need like another 20 minutes. I don't want to leave this guy with, you know, an unfinished headpiece. It's, a, you know, this guy's got to walk around with it every day. I'm ruining this guy's life.